Hello, I'm Luckman No Computer, and I do weird stuff with sounds and shit. <laughs> That's not very nice. Oh, anyway, this is Melanie, my girlfriend. And why is Melanie on this video? Do you know why? No, I don't know why. Do you know what this is? What is no, that? No, um, I think it's like a video synthesizer. No, it's actually, it's, that's a that's a rampage. And what that is, this is an envelope generator. So it gen generates envelopes? Yeah, yeah. Can you generate me an envelope, please? Well, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, flashback a couple of years, we built a couple of uh, kits that were by Bifaco in videos of building them. But the thing is, is you can go and build these yourself at workshops and you can purchase the kits yourself. Anybody can build them. And um, Melanie, oh, I've just figured, when was the last time you soldered? About three years ago. Three years ago, so you're a little bit rusty? I'm very rusty. That sounds great because I've got this for you. It's a Bifaco kit. The Bifaco Chopping Kinky, which is a Chopping Kinky module. Sounds pretty nice, doesn't it? Chopping Kinky. So yeah. I'm going to give you this. Kinky? Yeah, Chopping Kinky. It's okay. a Bifaco module and what you need to do is um, figure it out. There we go. Okay, let's have a look. We've got main board bag A and control board bag A. Can I just do this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, there's lots of... Guess you know I shouldn't what? mix them up. Do you know what this stuff is? Yeah? Yeah. Good. Okay, cool. It's all parts to build a kit. And then inside here... Oh, you get some nice stickers! Ooh, it's exciting. Okay, so we've got some instructions. Go read it. What, what's, what's, got, what's Chopping happening? Chopping Kinky v version 1. You've read it. Now you've got to figure out how to turn that, take that and build this. You've just got to build it. So I'm going to let you build it. Okay. I'm not going to help you. That's fine. I hey. am pretty sure that I can do this. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm sure. take it away. I'm just going to go and make myself a cup of tea. So um, I'll let you start. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> go on, you can figure it out. I'm already interfering too much. Yeah. Lead me to it. I can do it. So red. So you find R1 on here, I guess. Okay. So remember, if you're building one of these, always work out where R1 is because that's at the top of the PCB board. Like make it like a robot. Oh, okay. That's the perfect. <laughs> now I'll pop that in there. Uh, so fiddly. <laughs> fiddly thing. You can do this, Mel. Pull it from the back. Ah, Pull the legs a little bit outwards so it doesn't fall out again. That's perfect. That's all you have to do, now you've done it. Now you just got to do it a load of times. To make my robot first. Remember the robot. Remember the robot. This might be a two-parter series. <laughs> you can make it go fast about you on the time lapse. This might take somebody a whole uh, a workshop session. I need that. And the workshop sessions usually go from midday to about six o'clock. But you're supposed to be doing this in two and a half. I think I can do it in two and a half. I think I'll do it in five minutes. Have you seen this in action then? What, the chopping kinky? Yeah. No, I have not. Ooh, so this is slightly. the first time we're gonna find out what it does. If we could get it to work, fingers crossed. It will definitely work. But you go into the dark room later, right? Yeah. What are you doing in the dark room today? I am developing some film. What film? Um, 16 millimeter. I'm using coffee and vitamin C to make a developer, which okay. is really cool. Thank you very much. That was more of a grimace. I might have actually soldered my hair. So basically the Chopping Kinky kit comes with the front board, which has all the potentiometers on them, the twisty knob bits. And then also the one that Melanie's making, which is the circuit board. That's with all the brains of the actual machines. I'm gonna build the control board while she gets on with the brains behind the beast. Mine's the important bit, isn't it? This is like a date, isn't it? It's like a soldiery date. This is like a date. This is my kind of date. Meeting It'd be up. really long dates. <laughs> yeah, they wouldn't talk to each other either. So you've done the resistors, right? Yeah, done the resistors. Okay, now we're on to diodes. Diodes are polarized. You see, they've got these little black stripes on them. A white line on the diode must match with the white line on the diode symbols. So let me see on there. You see those?
Are you having fun? I'm having fun. Would that sound a bit more genuine than that? Come on. <laughs> I'm having fun. Good, good. I'm having fun. Okay. Well, <laughs> on the capacitors. Yeah. I would expect that to go there. That one's a TLO 72 CP. Get your leg over there. Hold on to it as well. The monster's clear. Wow. Yep. Yeah. Line it all up and make sure they all fit in their holes. Oh, that's it. I think that's it. Cool. Sick. So now you just got to put that back on. Make sure the bottom ones are lined up as well. They are indeed. Squeeze it all down. Wee, monkey woo. Ugh, there we go. Awesome. All right, Mel, you've done it. It's amazing, isn't it? How do you feel? I feel pretty amazed that I've built that in less than four hours. Four hours, that's pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. So yeah, we are gonna now go and test this at Mel's studio. Try and make some funky bleeps and bloops. Yeah, and exciting. Yeah, so let's go. Bye. So where are we now, Mel? We are in the dark room at Resort Studios. And this is where you work quite a bit, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Ooh, and you'll notice it's red. That's because you don't want to develop any of the uh, photos accidentally. So we've uh, turned all the lights off so we look like we're in a paranormal video. Here's the one that you made, the Chopping Kinky. And it worked! It worked first time. I did a quick little bit of calibration oh. and now it's, you know, plugged in. If we twist the knob, you'll notice some sound coming out. Ooh. So what the Chopping Kinky does is it doesn't distort the signal, it merely folds the waveform back on itself. So have a look at this oscillator and turn oh, yeah. that knob up slowly and just see it fold itself on itself. You see how it's folded? Like a bit of bread. <laughs> now twist the other knob. The Chopping Kinky can also act like a VCA, so it turns all the volume down, and when you press play, you can actually trigger it, so it acts like a funky version of a filter. So you're able to use it to be an additive filter, in a way. But anyway, have a play. So you need, you know these knobs, you know the octave, and you know the sequences, so make your sequence, Mel. And you built this and you're happy with that? Yeah, it's pretty amazing. All of your soldering worked. Yeah. It's amazing. High five. High five. Now back to the dark room. Now back to, yeah, I'll stop interrupting your photo developing and all that stuff, so I'll let you get back to that. So yeah, I've been Look Mom No Computer. And I've been Mel. That's the Chopping Kinky. Don't forget to subscribe and don't be scared. So try it. <laughs> you got it right. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,